Howdy ho, YouTube Anti Citizen One here. It is a lovely Sunday morning, and we are going to be continuing right where we left off. Um, <laughs> yay, yay! Alright, so uh, we uh, we actually didn't rescue Siri. <laughs> a bunch of just random loners did. But uh, we're just going to go ahead and pretend that we did. So, let's uh, let's head up to uh, Agaprom. we got to go see Mole and uh, the big stalker salt. We should be. Phasing out some of our equipment pretty soon for uh, 74s, 74Us. Let's see what's going on here. I don't know what this mod's like. Oh shit! Oh shit! I thought it was funny that this gate was bulletproof, uh, had bullet pen penetration. <gasps> oh my god, no! Bliet! Ah! Fuck. <laughs> Alright, we're doing that. We're gonna do that again. Um. Yeah, you know, I mean, if a grenade didn't cost a fucking thousand rubles, I probably would just chuck one right over the fence. But, um, what can we do? So let's see if we can sneak up on our extra sneaky, cheeky, breaky friend here. Get freaky. <laughs> Fuck you, son of a fucking bitch bandit. Piece of shit. I'm like fucking bleeding to death. One measly bandit. It's probably gonna fucking come out of the corner and brain me right now, watch. We just ran off. Let's go get him. See, if I put up bandits like this, uh, put up with them like this, then uh, the way a lot of the uh, generally where the bandits would be over here, like up all around this little spot, all up on top of the uh, the tunnel, and then to the left going towards Agroprom. Oh, let's get the fuck out of here before I get shot in the face. This isn't my problem. Oh no, I saw fucking bandits in the garbage. Like, who would have thought? I don't know where I read it. I think there was some original, some lore about how bandits would take stalkers as slaves and make them dig in the radioactive garbage uh, for artifacts. But I don't know if that was some fanfic or shit, or from a mod, or if it was like old lore. Our guys are here. Come on, bro, let's go. Hopefully, I don't have that fucking annoying cutscene. Ugh. Ugh. Boys, oh, I got some artifacts out here, but this is a little more pressing right now. Whoa! 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so military is clearly dominant right now. Zyga. Get him, boys. The fix got me cornered in the yard. Help me out, brothers. Let's try to save them all, and then we'll do some looting after. We gotta really try to get them, though. I'm all fucking banged up. I don't know if that was a good task updated or a bad. Oh, Alright, yeah, there we go. Alright, see if I can fall on the slider without breaking my fucking legs. 74s. Saved my life. I was too close. The drones always carry their missions through. Got to get out of here before the task force arrives. Oh, I always love this. Uh, I'll show you the way. This is probably one of my favorite models uh, for a 74. Which, uh, I don't know if this is a modification of like the uh, Clear Sky and Call of Pripyat hand model and AK, or if this was something someone did individually. But whoever worked on this model did fantastic work. It just it looks it looks like just very very well done. Um, we're just gonna go ahead and looting some bodies really quick because I really need. Whoa! What the fuck's going on here? Oh my god, was this a counterattack? Fucking bastards. I just wanna get some fucking medical supplies. Is that too much to ask? Oh. Alright, alright, alright. get the fuck out of here. Fuck this. We're winging it. One med kit. This is not good. But we are going to get gunned down by the fucking military if we stick around here. Nice. Didn't get to go back and get those artifacts either. Phew. It's quiet here. You can wait for the raid to finish. Zeri told me what you're looking for. Underground around here somewhere, but I don't know exactly where. Be careful. Good luck. All right, boys, you ready to go underground? Let's see what they got in store for me on this mod. I'm sure this is going to be a complete and total goat fuck. Bandits are in here, that's normal. Oh, I don't want to cross anything fucking too insane. Whoa! 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 Easy there, Chuck. Fucker. Where are you, son of a bitch? Oh, 
пацаны. Отходим. Фак. Flash doesn't go that far. Don't got any night vision, obviously. Honestly, fuck this P99. It's dead weight. And we're getting out of Saiga. I'm not fucking around here. Try to brain some people. Mmm, Bison 9mm. Also, I was never sure if it was bison or bison or something like that, but I'm assuming it was bison. <sighs> Bottom. Might not be a bad uh, personal defense weapon. <laughs> that was pretty damn close. It's everyone's favorite room. I don't think there's a second one. I don't remember what bot it was. <sighs> I don't remember what bot it was. I remember there was one mod where they put the fucking two of them down here. That was no fun. Really need to find a suppressor. Um. Obviously not for the uh, shotgun. Experienced enough. I'm not really a fan of this model, um, to be perfectly honest. I think this is a Lurk 1.1 model, because I think most of those guns come over the shoulder like that. I might be wrong, but I just never really was crazy with this model, but the Saiga is just so dangerous. This is just such a fucking dangerous weapon. You could just blow someone the fuck out with this thing, and uh, once you get it, especially this early on in the game, that's why it's kind of surprising. I mean, there was a number of stalkers with Saigas. Um, Alright, 
Let's take a look. See. Task failed. Oh, I, I think that's, that's supposed to happen actually. <laughs> there's a, yeah, there's a fireball back there. Okay. What do we got here? We got a bandit jacket. We got Strelon's Strelok's Mosin. That's interesting. A lot of med kits, which we desperately need. Some more grenades. We're fucking. We're gonna be millionaires, dude. We got all these grenades. Let's pick up everything. Um, just kind of sort through it for a minute. We're gonna do some inventory management. So we got a Mosin with a scope. Not, not terrible. Uh, I wasn't really a fan of this Mosin mod model either. I, I mean, I've only. I know there's a lot of variations on the Mosin noggin, and a friend of mine has a Mosin noggin uh, in real life. And, uh, you know, it didn't look like this. <laughs> I just feel like the, the, this was kind of a. Just, I don't know, it's a funky looking model. There's something off about it, and I can't really put my finger on it. I feel like it should be longer. I might be mistaken. I know there was many, many iterations of the Mosin Noggin, so it's like it'd be stupid of me just to say that, like, you know, one of them wasn't a short barrel version or something. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we finally have a radiation absorbing artifact that we can combine uh, with some other ones if we're we so inclined. Or we'll talk about losing endurance. Um, it hasn't really been a problem. You know what? Let's, uh,. Let's uh, let's do that. Let's get some bullet cap because we need to be tougher. We're we're just like some fucking complete shit, Lord. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go with the 74 over the 74U. Fuck the 74U. It's not worth it. And then this MP5. It's like I don't need to really carry this thing out of here with me, or what? We're a little overweight, and uh, I want to take this most at home with me. Four kilograms, 2.86. My team. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck the 9x19s. Fuck the MP5. It's a piece of junk. You don't really need it. Uh, I mean, I'm never coming back in this place ever again. So just maybe, maybe if there's some kind of mission to come in here. Red. We are still overweight. I mean, I have 300. Let's drop some 556 five, rounds. Do my eyes deceive me? I hate. I hate being underground. I can't stand it. I uh. This really would never, ever, ever be underground like this. Unless I had absolutely no choice. Alright, so I'm going to my management for now. Let's drop 10 more buckshot and uh, a little bit of pistol rounds or something. We need to just lose some weight. We're not using the pistol that much anyway. I just need to have something back to fall back on.
motherfuckers. The grenades in this game have always been phenomenal. It's actually probably one of my favorite... One of my favorite minor details in Stalker is the grenades. Uh, the fact that you could see the shrapnel flying through the air and hitting targets and like just... You know, it's not like a big explosion. That's not how these kind of grenades work. Uh, you know, I, I, mean, I know there are explosive grenades that will kill you just on explosive force, but... You know, most grenades' killing capacity comes from, or capacity capability rather, comes from shrapnel. Uh, you know, essentially the grenade explodes and shoots metal or like beads, depending on like what you're working with. Oh shit! Um, depending on what you're working with, and that's what you know kills people. But in this game, when you throw a grenade, you can actually see the shrapnel hitting all over the place on the walls. I always thought that was a very nice little detail. I actually just gave him my AK. Whatever. We're a little overweight, so I could lose a little, little bit of ammo. Being a lazy prick. Alright, this is probably my least favorite room. Second least favorite room, being underground here. These fuckers will just shoot you. Yeah. Oh boy. I'm totally going to use fucking shotgun. Take that fucking... Need that 30 rounds back. I like to spies this fucking room. Oh, fucker! Son of a fucking bitch! I just want to get the fuck out of here. Probably an ambient noise. But I just like hate this fucking room. I cannot stand this fucking room. Oh, yeah, look at this. Like, what the fuck are you supposed to do here? Like, this is come out like straight up and just like spray some fucking buckshot. I'm gonna try that right now. I guess I'm not gonna try that right now. <laughs> fucking get blasted like a dumbass. Okay, uh, combat quick saves. Okay, fuck you, you're dead. Son of a bitch. And you. You know, I was really hoping to be done with you guys. Who dares? I'm like blind, so I can't see shit. Oof. Fucker. Yeah. 
Yeah, you're dead. Fucker. As I was saying, I so rudely interrupted. I fucking hate this room. And this is one of the hardest spots in the early game. Just to fucking just climb your way out of I generally don't even really go this way uh, when I play Lurk. Actually, uh, when I play Lurk, the best thing to do after you get Strelok's equipment uh, is to fucking just leave back the way you came. And then with the, uh, the, the flash drive, you can actually go to the bar with just the flash drive. You don't need the military documents to get to the bar. And that is something I would like to check in this mod. I might do that, but I might not. It just depends. Cause, see, I like, uh... I like the ability to sneak into the military facility, steal the documents, and leave. And Lurk's the only mod where you can really do that. Whereas this mod... Uh... I don't really think there's a ton of stealth elements. Some funny lighting over there. Alright. Just fucking... <laughs> Fuck you! Okay, we are... Oh boy. Oh! Alright, lesson learned. Of your fucking life. Fuck you, controller. You'll never take me alive. Come on, come on. All right, this is my fucking hate because see, it's daytime out. There's helicopters flying on shit. I come out in like the middle of nowhere. Wow, oh my god. <laughs> This is what, yeah, like, lurk, it'd be nighttime. I'd just creep by with my little shitty PB9. No, I could take out the, uh, the alarm up there with my little silenced pistol. Uh, the alarm would never go off. not good. This is just not a good situation. I got myself here. And, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna suffer for it. Now I'm gonna suffer for it. I really would love, love, love to sneak the fuck out of here and just not deal with this. So we're gonna kind of do that, but not really. I just want to get out of here, just for a second. Let's take our bearings here, because uh, I really love to just go to the bar. I really don't. I don't have the equipment to fight a bunch of fucking military guys. I mean, I kind of do, but I really, 
would prefer to have a better suit. I prefer to have better, more accurate equipment. I, you know, there's a fucking helicopter flying around. I don't really know. Two goons down. Like fucking thirty more to go. Good start. Try to find an alternate pathway. Who dares? It's a guy like fucking shooting me like through a wall or something. <laughs> Kill as many of these fucking guys as possible, holy shit. Fuck glitching in and out, it's like an anomaly. Trial and error, folks. Trial and error. I was kind of expecting that to happen. And... Fucking son of a bitch. Oh, no. Please, no. Please, no. Please, no. Please, no. Don't even tell me. Four magazines left. Whoa, whoa. Oh, my God. They're everywhere. I'm just like completely surrounded right now. <laughs> Fucker. <laughs> oh my god, guys, we are in a bad fucking spot right now. See, that's why I think like, stealth should just be in this game. It, like, makes sense for stealth to be in a stalker game, because stalkers are ill-equipped to be doing shit like this. You know, just come in there and, like, fight an entire, you know, military division. It's just... not division, but you know what I mean. Like, an entire... This is a fucking lot of guys. This is like 30 fucking men. You know, and they have you do this at the start of the game. 
You know, whose dick do I gotta suck for a PSL one? Foggy, I think. Yeah, or I'm just fucking getting delusional. I don't like that noise. That sounds like a beginning of a blowout to me. How many think we dropped so far? Probably, I'd say, a good. Fifteen, maybe? It's just where, you know... A fucking alarm. Doing an infiltration. Chimera. Okay, they're just like, alright, well, you know, everyone's dead, let's just go back to playing music. <laughs> now I'm sure there's like a timer, and eventually it'll just turn itself off, otherwise it would just play forever. Who? Gives me that. Well, when I am playing Sneaky Breaky Lurk, I sneak into this base at nighttime, and then I go through this back window here. This is like fucking pro shit. You just climb through the window, and then boom, you're inside. You got a little suppressed pistol, you're sneaking in, it's dark, you know, there's patrols going by and stuff like that, you just shoot them in the head. And honestly, this game has so much, like, nostalgia factor to it, but I have always hated this fucking song. I have always hated this song. I never liked it. I always was just like, I always assumed that the music that they played was not because they liked this kind of music, but because they're in the middle of a fucking zone, and it's, you know, not easy to get, you know, new music. So they just play the same shit over and over again. I know what I'm gonna do, first and fucking foremost. Just make I don't get brained when I just walk around one of these corners. Getting a lot of film grain effect now, too, on my, uh... My view. I wonder if that has something to do with the incoming storm, or... It's definitely gonna rain. It's... It's about 5 o'clock, I wanna say. Was it... Tw oh, no, it's... It's like one... It's like 1.45. Uh, so we still have some time before the sun goes down. It's just, I want to get the fuck out of here. I, I need, we need to make it to the bar. We need to do it today. Hello, is anybody home? I don't know that there's like more like gas that's really valuable, but. Marked one. I told Barkeep about you. He should talk to duty guys to let you through. I suggest you go see him fast. 
All right, there's a lot of that gas here. Okay, so there's another canister there. Let's get the fuck out of here, boys. Just check, check this floor really quick. Maybe there's something good up here. Fast fire, like, guess who that was? Me spraying and praying, fucking military motherfuckers. Right, let's see, if we can't get the fuck out of here. Can I jump through the window? That would be pro. Yeah, baby. Alright, time to exfiltrate here. Take some ammo on the way out. We're getting out of here. We are so out of here. I don't want to get risk reckless here running out, but I want to get the fuck out of here. I got, I got a bad feeling about this. I just got a weird feeling like there's going to be a blowout or something. I just got that feeling. I don't like these noises. You know, I don't really know the indicators yet. There's supposed to be a chimera somewhere around here. I just heard a man. Yeah, there's definitely a crazy guy over there. I think that's part of a quest. Except I always thought he was in the army warehouses. Oh, I guess not. Piggy boys. What's up, you fuckers? Let's go check out that guy, see what his deal is. Maybe he's got some loot. I feel a little more comfortable now that there's some loners around. Stupid ass. <laughs> uh. Alright, alright, let's get to the bar. Fuck this. Oh, this is something I'll come back and check another time, maybe. If we ever have any more business out this way. suckers around these parts. It sounds like they won.
Fuck you, you son of a fucking bitch. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, wow. <laughs> Lucky as fuck. Fuck you, Agriprom. We are out of here. I'm not putting up with this shit. fucking everywhere. Artifact up there being guarded by some puppies. Some artifacts. All right, how many military you see? You got one, two, three. Okay, I've got one, maybe two. I think I just dropped that second guy. There's still one more. At least I think. I think there was one more. Just want to get the fuck out of here, man. Just want to get out of here. Yeah, what happened here? Ah! Oh! I deserve that. I deserve that one. Okay. Alright, so there's two more military. There's one behind this van. I really don't like the sound of that. Yeah, there we go. Now we got him. Watch it be a fifth guy. <laughs> yes. Need some meds, man. Real bad. Just get the fuck out of here. Just get out of here. Fuck this place. Fucking hacker problem. We get like eaten by blood suckers. <laughs> no thanks. Getting back to the garbage, get the money from the bandits. Alright. Marked Juan is getting getting pretty worn down here. He's a little overweight. Run out of ammo. Crack open a fucking cold beer. I wish. Wish I had a cold beer right now. You know, it's five o'clock somewhere. But oh 
my god. This is like fucked, dude. Worst fucking gunfight ever. <laughs> Two guys just shooting at each other who can't fucking hit anything. Alright. I'm pretty sure that's military right there. It's on military again. I think it is. Yep, yeah, military. Fucker. All right, we're good. Let's get the fuck out of here. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Be safe. Be safe. Um, I'm assuming that's a stalker. <laughs> ah, thank goodness. Always good to see the boys. Alright, we're in the home stretch here, boys. This is good. We're almost to the bar. Oh, is that some gasoline? Interesting. now. That's very cool though. I'm guessing that then there's probably vehicles in this mod. Uh, or maybe it's used for something alternatively. But we're in the money. We're in the fucking money. About to get back to the motherfucking bar. Get some wood. You ever just run while pouring energy drink all over your face and drink at the same time? <laughs> Fucking normies, Ray. What do you guys usually side with? Duty or freedom? Or Buzz do you off, stay? Stalker. We don't Whoa. let every loser go through. Buzz off, stalker. We don't let every loser go through. What are you standing there for, stalker? Okay. Um. And there's no anomalies on the road here. That's probably the first time I think in my entire life. Oh, well. So much for that. Okay, we made it sorta to the bar. There's just one last obstacle. Everyone's favorite pack of dogs. Just, you know, fucking terrorizing you. Every Oh, cool, they have a fucking pseudo-dog. Just, just... Swell. How swell. You know, someone's getting, like, mangled over there. No! <laughs> Fucking mangy mutt. <laughs> you know, back at, like, a fucking crippled dog is coming after me. I'm fucking... I'm fucked, dude. It's over. It's over. No! No! 
You fucker, I can't see shit. Girl, you fucking son of a bitch, fuck you. Fuck you, dude, yes! Holy shit. Fucking bastards. This is like the, the struggle of the marked one. Just like. Just like. <laughs> you just make it everywhere by the skin of your balls. <sighs> we made it. We are in safe hands now. We got the duty guards. We are going to wrap it up for today. I might actually do a part four a little later on, but it sounds like to me that uh, the marked one here needs a little bit of a a little bit of a rest. But um, I would love if you would like and subscribe to this video. The more likes and subscribes I get, the more driven. You have something to say to me, bro? If I got more likes and subscribes, uh, it would just be a nice gauge to know, um, you know, what, what you guys want to see. I'm guessing a lot of you are Stalker fans. I'm sure I have a couple people, if you're even watching this, who kind of watch some of my Warhammer videos. Which I plan on keeping up on both of them. But, um, yeah, we made it to the bar. It's a beautiful day relative <laughs> to zone and uh yeah hope you guys enjoyed this one uh we'll see you soon peace